Good evening, this is Eleven Colors. It's now 3 a.m. and I've just gotten home from a couple of hours of drum practice. And before that, I had three and a half hours of working out at the gym and I guess a total of 12 minutes in the sauna. And over here, if you look very carefully, you can see that I now have four balls. Four solar powered balls. They're not on right now because I've got the lights on. Actually, should I try? Let me try seeing if they light up at all. Can you even see them? They're very faint. I've got them on the windowsill. And I bent all the legs so the, so the solar panels point outside. So during the day, they can pick up just enough charge to have a little bit of light when I get home. This, this is an actual garden outdoor spike thing that has no, these all have like rechargeable batteries inside. This has no battery that can be replaced. And this is about, what, 500? How much is this thing? Is the price even on there? Anyways, this I got at the home center section, the hardware section at a department store in Sangenjaya. That was sort of an experiment. It's got a solar panel on top, and I sort of pointed it outside and picked up enough sun. And uh, they still light up when I, like, right after I get home, but late at night, they don't light up so much anymore. And that might not seem like a lot, but if we ever lose electricity, that'll, that might be all we have for a little while. So those are my four solar balls. And a bunch of other solar gadgets that I'm playing with, but uh, that's not what I'm talking about right now. I can play around with these later. But um, solar light, and this is a solar USB charger, and this is a solar KTI charger. And I've got all these here just in case I need them. Don't need them right away, but I don't need them right away, but I might need them in the future. You never know. And over here, I have a huge pile of used tissues from box opening porn right here. And these are the boxes that I haven't even broken down yet. Out in the hallway here, and let me turn on the lights in the hallway. These are a whole bunch of other boxes, a whole bunch of other Amazon boxes in the box that I got the treadmill in that I had to chop up. Oh, and this is the frame for the old chair that I use. I haven't, this is, this I have to throw out with the unburnable garbage, which is only two weekends a month, and I can never remember which Saturday is it is, if it's the first Saturday or the second Saturday. And by the time I figure it out, it's always too late. But anyways, tomorrow is Wednesday, which makes it Shigen, what is it, Resource Recycling Day. So it's Recycling Day in my neighborhood, which is a good thing. I mean, trash is separated in Japan. I can't just throw this out with the burnables. Stuff like cardboard and paper and uh, milk cartons and pet bottles. The uh, plastic bottles that you get drinks in. Are they even called pet bottles in the States? I never heard the term before I came to Japan, I don't think. But anyways, so these all get recycled, which is a good thing, because the alternative would be burning them. And uh, I used to live in Suginami Ward in Tokyo, and a few blocks away on the other side of the Seibu Shinjuku line was a garbage incinerator that was deep underground, and uh, it supposedly burned things up a whole lot, so nothing remained to pollute the neighborhood, but there was this thin black dust that collected everywhere in my apartment. And that was the result of having an incinerator nearby. But uh, these will be recycled. These won't be burned to put dust everywhere. So uh, separating your garbage is a good thing because it means in the long run less cleaning up around the house. All right. This has been 11 Colors, about to wrap this stuff up so I can put it out for the garbage truck recycling people and thank you for watching